Right, so this is breaking news episode number 1,586, and in this video we're going over some new updates which just dropped their ring to Prodigy. What's going on everyone, One Doctor Genius here, and welcome back to the breaking news episode of Prodigy. Alright guys, if you're like me, you just sometimes randomly log off your Prodigy to see if updates happen, right? And when you do, you guys usually check around everything. Well, today, during my normal check, I opened up our inventory and saw this. Kapowie? What is this? What's up with the wands tab? What's up with the items tab? What's up with the currency tab? Well, we have to check this out, obviously, right? So, yeah, it seems like Prodigy did some icon updates, so let's check this out. Alright, let's head over to wands. So, number one, it does seem like they've updated the image of the wands, which is the enchanted stick. The only change which they made in the entire wands tab was to the enchanted stick. I went down to, I went down in all of my other wands and you guys can see not a single wand has changed other than the enchanted stick. So it seems like Prodigy decided to change part of the wands, which I guess is okay. But after this what you will see will shock will shock you. Right, so next over we head over to items. Right now on the front of items it seems like it used to be a tooth last time, or however far I can remember it used to be a tooth. It seems like Prodigy changed that to a new update version of it, right? Let's click on the items tab and see what we have. Ha! What is this? Nani? What is this? What did Prodigy do to the items tab? And first up, you guys can see that Firefly remains the same. But the second you look at everything else, you're like, what? What in the world happened here? So let's take a look at Tin Can. It seems like Prodigy decided to update their Tin Can. Let's look at Tooth, Prodigy decided to update their teeth. Monster Notes, updated. Old Sock, updated. Large Scale, updated. So you guys can see Prodigy just went around updating everything in their way. And it doesn't seem like this can is too old, it looks brand new and shiny. An old tin can would have probably started rusting. This tin rusts? Let me check something. Seems like this actually is accurate because tin does oxide, although it doesn't oxide too fast. Now, if you guys don't know what oxide means, it means um, chemical reactions between the metal and the atmospheric gases along with moisture and other stuff. But yeah, you guys can see. So, it seems like that the tin can is accurate and the tooth is also accurate because it looks ancient. Tooth. Alright, so it seems like they've updated the monster's tooth, which is pretty cool, although I preferred the old one because it was on a necklace. Next up, we have the bouncy note, which has a little bit of handwriting on it and it's taped together. Now, if you guys ask me, this bouncy note looks pretty cool, if you guys ask me. I mean, the bouncy note is one thing which actually looks good with the update. Now, next up, if you scroll down over here, you guys can see they have the old sock and they have large skill. Now the thing about the large skill is that this icon is actually an icon of another element in the game. An element which was of another element in the game. Now I'm going to see if I can find which element its icon is from. But you guys can tell this icon over here has already been used somewhere else in the game which is not obtainable for players at all. Now over here you guys can see you have confetti which just stay the same. But next to that you guys get yourself the factory key. And it seems like they did update the factory key to some sort of pressure gauge which is at medium. It should be at green because green is supposed to be safe, but yeah, it seems like they have a pressure gauge which looks actually This arguably this arguably does actually look pretty good if you guys ask me And next to beside it we have the captain's quarters key and you guys can tell it's the captain's quarter key because it has the steering wheel of a ship now this does confuse me because it has because this um the steering wheel of the ship I'm mean, not what is the steering wheel of a ship called? Someone tell me in the comments down below. <laughs> but either way, this looks like one of those cogs which you find in those machines which turn around. So I actually got confused between these two because the captain's quarters key actually looks like a factory key. So Prodigy might need to work on this, but other than that, that also looks nice. Now let's keep on scrolling down. Ah yes, the master's key. Another key which... It, Another key specifically made by Prodigy to confuse the living daylight out of me. Which one is the which one is which one is the Skywatch key? I don't know. This also looks like it's an electric key. Ah, as you can see, it is made for Skywatch. But yeah, it seems like Prodigy made a couple of their designs a bit too close, a bit too confusing. But other than that, these designs actually do look pretty cool. Ah 
Ah yes, now let's continue scrolling down and for a bit they haven't changed any of the morph marbles or potions. So we can just continue gliding on by that. Now the Florian's office key was already like that, but then over here you guys can see we have Le Croissant. And it seems like Prodigy updated the art of Le Croissant. And it seems like it seems like that the croissant has been uh, polished. <laughs> what the <laughs> Oh my god, the croissant has been polished, yes. Someone decided to wax and polish the croissant and make it shinier. But basically, you guys can see it looks delicious. It's an item used during battles and it heals 25% of your health. Now, if you ask me, a croissant is going to be very helpful for your wizard. And if you continue scrolling down, you guys will notice that Prodigy doesn't actually decide to make any more updates. Although, it would be kind of crazy if Prodigy decided to like update the entire thing, which would have blown your minds off, but nope. Yeah, then after scrolling down for a couple of centuries, we come to the apple, and it seems like Prodigy made these apples an update. Now, it does seem like these- Alright, so, I guess the old apple was kind of boring, and this one has reflection on it, but still, apple is like, meh, 5 out of 10, previous apple was like 10 out of 10, IDK, maybe I'm old school Prodigy. But yeah, I prefer the old version of these things than Prodigy majority of the time. But yeah, not gonna lie, the apples just look good. And then over here, you guys have the pizza and the cake. Now, if you guys ask me, the pizza and the cake actually do look good. They look like someone actually put uh, these guys. The pizza and the cake actually look good. Like, these can stay. Like, the previous ones can go. Now, the pizza looks like we're getting ourselves a pepperoni and green chili or jalapeno pizza, which is pretty nice, if you guys ask me. And it seems like that they haven't updated much of the information about it. But other than that, we have that now for the cake. It seems like we've gotten ourselves a um, chocolate cake with vanilla frosting in the middle of it with chocolate on top. Along with some vanilla decorations and strawberry. Maybe that's strawberry frosting, I don't know. But either way, you guys can tell they also updated the cake and it looks absolutely delicious. Cake. A cake? I guess monstrous celebrate birthdays too. So yeah, it does seem like it does 75% of your health return to you, right? And finally, and definitely not least, we have the currency section. What currency has been updated in Prodigy? We shall find out now. What currency has been updated in Prodigy? We shall find out now on our next episode after this quick short. We shall find out now on the next episode of Prodigy updates. Okay, nah, just kidding. That's not gonna happen. Let's check the currency section and see if Prodigy made any updates. So it's pretty obvious that they made updates to the icon, right? Yeah, that's obvious. But did they upgrade any of the currency? No. It seems like that the copper coins remain the same, the wood remains the same, the dragonflies remain the same, the titan shots, the hot hots, the yaws. The Floria, the arrows, the magical eggs, the khaki pages, the star shards, the plant research point, the water research point, the gold, the fire research point, the sand dollars, the shivers, and the candy corn remain the same. Yep, no up, no change. Now let me just check my other account because that might have some currency in it, right? Yeah. Oh uh, yes guys, so it seems like the prodigy just decided to change all of the icons and it seems like that is the only thing which I was able to find. Maybe you guys were able to find more stuff or less. But either way, I hope you guys found this video sort of informational and entertaining and figured out what Prodigy is doing. It seems like they're updating the icon, so be prepared to be confused under certain cases, right? Sometimes maybe one of the wants might be a little bit too close to the other one and you're like, what? And other times you're like, oh, that's smart, right? But yeah, guys, um, amazing work, Prodigy people. Your art design is amazing. Right, and guys, that's all for this video. I hope you guys found this informational and entertaining. And if you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell, and give this video a humongous thumbs up and share it with your friends, right? And yeah, that's all. I'll be catching you all next time. One Doctor Genius out the house. Bye and have a good time.